What's up, guys? This is Wabby, and you know, after reading the report that I just got done reading, it's sickening. I just had to take a nap. It put me to sleep. It really put me to sleep. Absolutely put me to sleep. It was that bad. Horrible. Because Brian Strowman, that walking advertisement for a ratings killer, the person that can't wrestle himself out of a wet paper bag, the person that clearly proved this past Monday on Raw that he can't even talk on the microphone, he can't cut a decent promo is about to face somebody that is equally as bad. His first major stinking rivalry. His first major feud is going to be just as bad. The Big Show! Well, it's The Big Show! Give me a break. Let me go back to sleep. That's what I'll be doing every Monday night from now on once this rivalry starts. Going to sleep. Going to take a whiz. Going to get something to eat. Going to get something to drink. This rivalry is not worth our time. Is not. You expect us to watch these two guys wrestle. You expect us to watch these two guys wrestle. Two guys that can barely move in the ring. Oh, oh. Braun Strowman, you all play it up like he can really run fast in the ring. You play it up that he can run fast in the ring. He can barely lift his leg up to give a big boot. He barely performs a decent clothesline. He puts his arms up and he yells, A backward choke slam and he's done. Broad Strowman has not proved anything to me. And then we have the Big Show! What has the Big Show proved to us? I mean, really. What has the Big Show proved to us? Since 1999. Really. I, I, I mean, really. Nothing. The Big Show is there to help put stars over. He's a waste of talent. Absolutely. This match is going to be like watching paint dry. You might as well hit the ratings button and have it go downhill. You are giving the fans a reason to turn the TV off. Sticking these two wrestlers on. In the ring at the same time. And I thought wrestling was bad. Now, it's just getting worse. Two things we have to look forward to, wrestling fans. <sighs> Roman Reigns versus Kevin Owens for the Universal Championship. Yeah, that's one. Because that's intimate on Monday Night Raw after the Survivor Series. That's one rumor. And now this. What? You're going to put that as a mid-card for Roadblock? It's more like Rogue Kill, because you're killing us by making us watch this. Awful. Absolutely awful. You have Braun Strowman's yell, Braun Strowman's backwards chokeslam, versus 
the Big Show's yell and his punch. That really gives us a reason to turn on the television. That really gives us a reason to even want to watch Monday Night Raw. You know what? And I've been saying this a lot lately, but Vince McMahon, Kevin Dunn, and all the rest of the people that decide what rivalry goes on where and who gets who can go on one place. Can go on one place. And yes, I know I'm still on the quote and catchphrase from Chris Jericho, but that's exactly where they can go. And you know what? Monday Night Raw can go on this too. They can go on the list of Jericho. Ink it in, man! Because Raw sucks. This is proof that Raw sucks. That you are making us go through this. If this actually goes through. The only positive thing out of this entire ordeal is that Sami Zayn is not being buried by getting fed to Braun Strowman. How ignorant. How ignorant. I get it. You're using the Big Show as his first opponent to build up Braun Strowman so you don't have to keep feeding him jobbers. I get that. It's what you've been doing for years. No creativity, WWE. No creativity whatsoever. Absolutely none. You've been doing the same stuff for years now. Absolutely years. When are you going to do something different? When are you going to give us some creativity? You know what? If it's not the big show, it would be Mark Henry. Mark Henry would probably be his second opponent. I'd be, I'd be more happy with Mark Henry. At least Mark Henry is somebody, somebody, somebody that people halfway like and somebody that people will halfway be entertained by. Give me a break. The Big Show and Braun Strowman. Make me want to vomit. So when this happens, you know, for those of you that watch my Monday Night Raw reviews, expect me probably to, number one, either, either gripe a ton over this rivalry, or to just skip past it. Each and every Monday. This is disgusting. I have no more to talk about. When it comes to this. So. Until I see you again. Let me know what you're thinking. In the comments below. Facebook. Webby at 2007 Webby. Twitter. Webby at 2007 Webby. Until I see you again. This is Webby. And I'll catch you on the other side. Talk to you later.